It's the loudest, most politically incorrect TV show on the planet. Everybody, come on in. It's time for Tommy's Garage. With your host, Tommy Atkins. Your mechanic, Rosie Rosencrantz. The Chocolate Thunder, Gavin Babineau. And Brittany Lee. With special guest, comedian Mike Rayo. Comedian Sam Griesbaum and Houston filmmaker Matthew Miller. I'm Matthew, the voice Gidry. It's time for Tommy's Garage. Everybody, welcome to Tommy's Garage. Yeah. Are you guys all ready for a great show? Yeah. We got one for you. <laughs> so, welcome to my garage. Is everybody ready for the big news? Yeah. yeah. All right, here we go. What, 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 Rosie, hey man, the healthcare bill, it's dead. Check it out. You can yeah. keep your doctor, you can keep your plan. 28 times he said it. 28 times. And it was a lie and he knew it was. Ooh. And now it's hurting this country irreparably. You know, for seven years you had an easy route. We'll repeal, we'll replace, and he's never going to sign it. But I'm signing it. <laughs> we can repeal but we should repeal and replace, and we shouldn't leave town until this is complete, until this bill is on my desk. There you go. Until we all go over to the Oval Office, I'll sign it, and we can celebrate for the American people. Woo! There you go. Woo! Rosie, Trump is pissed. Yeah, and at this point, President Trump, Republicans can't even effectively pass gas right now. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's oh, big right. bell. Uh, he's demanding this. He can wish in one hand and grab all the f he wants at the other one, but unless he can get that to vote in Senate, Nothing I think it's a happen. bit of necrophilia if you ask yeah. me. Yeah. Dead oh. on arrival. Ooh, that's Dead a, on arrival. I think Congress better pay attention now. Our, our principal Trump is going to take away their recess. Oh. 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 In their sandbox. <laughs> now, the deal is we've got to get rid of the Progublicans, these guys that ran as Republicans who basically want to be liked by the media and they want to be liked by the people on the left, they got to get over it because the people that they're trying to make like them are never going to vote for them anyway. That's exactly. right. Yeah. That's right. Yep. Exactly. Look, I can't figure out who I hate more, Democrats or Republicans. I'll take both. Yeah. 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 I bang myself, so to speak. Uh, Rosie for president. Speaking of people we hate, it's been a while, but if we're talking about people to hate, let's go to the top of the list. That means it's time for Big <laughs> Oh, that's what the soundbite was for. I thought it was just because that was cool. <laughs> yes, yes. The latest poll says Donald Trump only has 36% support. Guess who's worse? This bitch. Hillary Clinton at 34%, Rosie. <laughs> yeah. Hillary just needs to, to take a bath while recharging her Blackberry already. Yeah. <laughs> what, too soon? Too soon? No. no. <laughs> that was a that was You a got hammer. both. You got them both. The media is actually, they're actually talking about this, strangely enough. It's, it's out there, they know it, and they're admitting it, which I think is kind of, they need to take the hint from it, because otherwise, they're about to be less popular than Trump. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but the story will disappear in two days. Yeah. The latest poll proves that Hillary Clinton is only slightly more popular than a painful rectal itch. Oh! <laughs> oh, but now the painful rectal itch is talking to Jill Stein and demanding a recount. So yeah! 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 <laughs> is that the brown? Look, party? everybody knows here. If the media was forced to tell the truth, <laughs> uh, he, uh, Donald Trump would be like 90% approval. But you know, we need the truth about these bastards. That's why I watch Tommy's Garage, right? Yeah! That's right, that's right. Yeah. Why were the subject of stupid liberal women this week? Feminist protests in the NRA. Who they have with them? Armed guards. <laughs> <laughs> Rosie, does hypocrisy get any greater than this? Yeah, and that was Linda Smellsour. Hey, <laughs> it's okay in Sharia law to beat your women, so can I come over there and give her a box of slaps now? There you go. Yeah. Yeah. She likes Sharia law. <laughs> You, there you, you go. Know, you know, Rosie, well, I don't think that these liberal baby-hating feminists are as stupid as they look. No, they're really not. <laughs> they got guys with guns there. You know? yeah. I think revolution just is, just for Linda, I don't think revolution's your game. 
I don't know. Let's have a history quiz. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> in this house. Uh, once again, if the gun owners were really as violent and troublesome as the left has always made out, us out to be, there would be no left. Right. right. Ah. Exactly. Yeah. There's millions of us. Exactly. Just think how well she'd do at uh, making speeches in Saudi Arabia. Yeah. Look, you know, I love how... Stone I, that I, bitch! I, I, lo I love I how a woman who preaches that Sharia law should be the law of the land is now a feminist icon. Exactly. Yeah, like, like liberal, liberals really are retarded. And I don't mean mentally challenged. I mean... No, really freaking retarded. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And last, Donald Trump declared this week Made in America Week. Bro. He showcased American products from every state. He asked us to buy American first, Rosie. So does this mean all the... Hats are going to be made in America now? <laughs> I like that. Seattle. I was going to say he sold the trademark. Yeah. Okay. Made in America Week, brought to you by your friendly neighborhood commies, the Chinese. Yeah. <laughs> I think the thing I love about it is it points out something important that we all need to remember. We're Americans. We make things. Yes. Yeah, there are two things we do well. We, we design, build, produce, and sell convenience devices that save you a lot of time. And we kick ass on tyrants. And right yes. now, yes. There you Kim Jong-un had better be praying to God that we're making stuff and not looking him up, because I'd like a little Korean takeout right about now. Oh. 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 Wow, you got both on that Very one. little Korean takeout. Yeah. 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 He's, he's going to he's gonna get a 20 megaton. nothing he's, left he's, over. He's going to get a 20 megaton enema. He's going to find out what it's all about. And we'll but, be hungry 30 minutes later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll bomb him 30 minutes later. By the way, by the way, in case you missed it, the juice is on the loose. <laughs> <laughs> yep. OJ got off today. Rosie. Okay, so Tommy wanted us to write some little limericks, I guess. Sure, right? why so, not? So here's the one I wrote. OJ is free. Ladies run for your life. Now he's using a condom instead of a knife. Oh! Oh! oh. Yeah. Wow! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> OJ made parole. Now he's free. They needed to sell for Bill Cosby. No! Oh, nice! <laughs> it did bring a tear to you, didn't it? <laughs> Orenthal has made parole the second time he tried, but he never would have went to jail if Cochran hadn't died. Oh! <laughs> you know, I, don't, I don't know if he's a threat to society, but if you know any woman who's dating him, don't bring him any sunglasses. No. <laughs> Would this be considered a dark joke? Speaking of cool sunglasses, let's say hello to Tommy's Gross announcer, Matthew Gidry. Okay, Matt, Matthew, OJ's free. Hey, how did you guys like the way Johnny Cockroach made up all those poems? <laughs> yeah, something tells me you got a few of them, Matt. Oh, I feel good about it. How did you know, Tommy? <laughs> you guys want to hear a few O.J. Simpson poems? Yeah. <laughs> if O.J. is free, stay away from me. If you don't like my sunglasses, I'll stab you in your asses. Come on, Matt. One more. One more, Matt. One more. Okay. <laughs> I can't see it. <laughs> Take your sunglasses Take your sunglasses off. Off. No, I need just two lines missing, you dumbasses. They're right there. <laughs> if you don't treat me like right, I will stab you all night. <laughs> I like that. All right. Well, hey, Matt, if you don't go today, you're going to lose all your pay. So I lose five bucks. Who gives a Okay, later on, we have the professionals and the bigot lottery. But first, coming up, it's Worldwide Panic, only on Tommy's Garage! You locked your deadbolt, but this happened. Why? Because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins. You need Armor City Doors. There were over one million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone. But when deadbolts fail, Armor City Doors protects. Guaranteed. 713-487-5539. Or stop by ArmorCityDoors.com. Remember, deadbolts do not stop kick-ins. But when deadbolts fail, you need Armor Armor City Doors. ArmorCityDoors.com.
Healthcare system, broken. The FDA, broken. And the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. Come on, dude, you're supposed to be helping me clean the pool. You're gonna get me in trouble again. Yeah, all right, I'm coming. Yeah, this is the big lottery. Every week we scour the world to find the biggest idiots who do the dumbest things, and we force ourselves to get... I'm not getting in trouble because of him again. I'm getting proof he's not working. Come on, man, we gotta clean the pool. They're shopping at Walmart, riding horses, and doing... Look at that, is that crazy or what? That's crazy. Why are you watching this? So funny. He's watching the bigot lottery on Tommy's garage. Dude, you just made the bigot lottery. Ah! Hey, where can I get good local news? Pick up the Bayou City Bull. How about a good karaoke get bar? The Bayou City Bull. Great night. The Bayou City Bull. A good ice the house. The Bayou City Bull. Dry cleaner. The Bayou City Bull. Massage therapist. Bayou City Bull. Hair salon. Bayou City Bull. Nail salon. Nail salon. For a friend. Oh, and a bail bondsman. Wild night. It's for a friend. A friend. Yeah. The Bayou City Bull has local news, local entertainment, local businesses. It even has a joke page, coupons, and Houston calendar girls. Bay Town to Katy. Kingwood to Clear Lake. If you want to know what's going on, pick up a copy of the Bayou, Bayou City, City Bull. Bull. BayouCityBull.com. And Twitter. Stories joining me and Rosie is the magic man for several reasons, not all of which can be disclosed today. It's Mike Rayo! Yeah! Mike, 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 What is that? Oh, wow. what? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny! Yeah. That was a <laughs> premature copulation. <Yeah. laughs> let's say hello to the magic monster, and you know pretty much all the reasons why he deserves that name, but we know him as Mr. Chocolate Thunder. It's Gavin Babino! Oh, that's me! Hello! Hello, hello, hello. Thank you. That's a nice guy. That's a nice one, guy right there. You got one chocolate. Let's start at CNN headquarters. And just, just watch this here. In the most from their relationship. And before you answer that, let's just listen into the French national anthem for just a moment. <laughs> the French, there's a French national anthem, folks. The what? U.S. American national anthem, I should say. That's what's oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm so yeah, that's stupid. Yes, American CNN Fox. anchor Poppy Harlow doesn't know the national anthem, Rosie. And I think Poppy's next journalistic assignment will be with the Cartoon Network. Yeah, really. Oh, yeah. Oh. I think you're right. Oh. Yeah. Did you guys know that, <laughs> did you know that Miss Poppy Dingbat went to Columbia University? Yeah. That explains the, a lot. You know, the home of Obama, Holder, and even, hell, even James Franco. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so <laughs> I had no idea that you could pay so much to be a America-hating liberal. It's, yeah. 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 it's just sad. Yeah. It's just sad. Being a, being a liberal she bitch is wish. expensive. Yeah, I got a message for uh, Poppy on the uh, France Cowards News Network. Uh, <laughs> if you're ever confused about whether it's the uh, national anthem of the United States or not, just check to see if Colin Kaepernick's on his knees. <laughs> ah, yeah. That is a bell. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, she, she could probably sing the 1979 Soviet Union national anthem backwards in Russian, though. I know that. Look, then again, sometimes there are words you just don't want to know. The Walmart website sometimes uses descriptive language to describe the products. Sometimes a little too descriptive. 
<laughs> yes, perhaps. A bit too descriptive, Rosie. Did you see this? Anybody see this? Yeah. Yes. What color brown is that? Uh, Na nagger. Nagger. <laughs> ah. Can I, can I buy a vowel? Yes, <laughs> 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 Out of order. <laughs> oh, my God. Tommy, Tommy, this was just a bad translation. The original, in the, re in the original language, it was bad parent brown. Ooh. Ooh. Ouch. Hey, hey, hey. Ouch. But to be fair, it also comes in green and yellow. Oh. oh. How about cracker white? Where's the airplane crash? Crash white. I mean, oh, oh, my, oh my God. I, I think for his birthday, he just unleashed white privilege on all of us. Ah. So, okay, he, he, he is correct. This was a Chinese screw up. However, they were supposed to end it with uh, not er. Ah. <laughs> they, were, they were supposed to be cool and, and Right. Uh, <laughs> it looks more like brown to me anyway. Uh, <laughs> when did the clan get into making black hair care products? That's what I'm exactly. To yeah. <laughs> it's the Margaret like, Sanger I, I edition. I can't even okay. imagine the KKK thinking this up, but if you get stupider than the KKK, you are now king of stupid land. Exactly. Right? <laughs> Speaking of stupid, consider this guy, Bill Hillman from Chicago. He's in a hospital. Why? His gay lover are pounding him right at the ass? No. no. Uh, Department of Motor Vehicles pat him up the ass? No. no, he did the old-fashioned way, running with the bulls in Pamplona. Oh my God. Yeah, the bull got him, and when he was in the hospital, he started complaining about Americans oh. and how Spanish people are superior to Americans. Check out what he said right here. You're boring, pathetic, fat, dumb people who vote for Donald Trump and have no interest except McDonald's and malls. Wow. America, by and large, is full of idiots. Wow. Ooh, now who else do we know runs with the bulls? None other than Rosie Rosencrantz. Yeah. Okay. And guess what I have? Hey, hey, hey. Oh. I have a blackmail photo. Oh, Ladies yeah. and gentlemen. Ah. Wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> I, I, know, I know Bill Hillman. I've even run with the Bulls with Bill Hillman for a couple of years now. Are you jealous? He got oh, and, and, and the name yes. of the Bulls that were running, that got him, were the Deploras. <laughs> oh. So I think the Deploras. <laughs> the Deplora Bulls are fed up with this Tommy liberal Chicago douche nozzle. Yeah. Go, back to the go back to the other one. Go back to the other one. That one. Right there. No, no, no. That. that. Go back. There you go. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> so he's got it. Oh, right. Oh. 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 He's got CNN. Trump. 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 That, it, that really is the Trump train, isn't it? Oh. 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 All right. So let me get this straight. Liberal Chicago guy survived weekend shootings to get raped by a bull, and he's going to talk shit about my country? Yeah. yeah. Right. If you don't like it, get out, bitch. Bye. There you Done. go. Done. He just says I'm stupid because I spend my Saturdays eating McDonald's and going to the mall. He knows me really well. But, yeah. <laughs> you know, I've come back from the mall with indigestion, but I never come back with a bullhorn up my ass. <laughs> <laughs> and then he, he had the nerve to say that we watch too many Disney movies. Apparently, this guy didn't miss this Disney classic right here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Love an idiot. You know this guy? Yeah, he's running next as a carnival clown there. <laughs> hey, just a little reminder. Let's compare Spain with a stupid American, shall we? Let's check it out. The average American income, $60,000. The average Spanish income, $37,000. Yeah, look, look there, commie boy. I have McDonald's and shopping malls and my own national TV show. You have a bullhorn up your ass. <laughs> I'm leaning toward my world. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Well, some people are stupid, but there's still some great people out there. This guy keeled over in a restaurant. Look at that. He had wow. no pulse for 45 minutes, Holy but the paramedics never gave up on him. And here he is today. Check it out. Rosie, wow. he's just fine now. Dead for 45 minutes? I guess he was just practicing his Bernie Sanders impersonation. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Man. I mean, isn't this amazing? First, big shout out to the boys in blue yep. and yes. red. Yes. 
Holy According to the story, the circumstance of miracles that happened to make this guy live was amazing. Yep. But the real question, what the hell did he eat? <laughs> That's my question. <laughs> That's what I want to know. <laughs> yeah. Democratic sandwich. Could, yeah, Gavin, right. I mean, the police were there in a moment, and they never gave up on the guy, so the police basically saved this guy's life. And I Googled it, and you know what I found? Nothing on CNN, CBS, NBC, MSNBC, right. because a cop did something good. Right. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. No, look, no, no blue. <clears throat> wait, no hang blue. on, no, no pulse? There's... <clears throat> You got him all choked up. And he got here. Somebody dial 911. If there's no pulse, there's still hope for Mitch McConnell. <laughs> Speaking of men with no pulse, New England Patriots coach Bill Belichick, the man with ice water running through his veins, was seen wearing this T-shirt. What's it say? This. Nice. Oh, look nice. Yeah. He may have ice cute? water in his veins, but man, the lip tarts boil over when they saw that t-shirt, Rosie. <laughs> and as I looked at that shirt, I thought it was a photograph of Bill and Hillary's first date. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hillary's on the left. Yeah. Any yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hell, she might be the <laughs> damn dog. <laughs> No, I bet she was the she was the damn dog in this picture. Uh, <laughs> between you, me, and the fence post, I'm pretty sure if that was a priest, ESPN would have covered it and absolutely loved it. However, yeah. it, it, it's and it, it's sad. However, sorry, not sorry. I I am, I'm sorry. I'm just so choked up right now because I, I love that. I love seeing. Evil radical Muslims get killed. It's great. Simple. It yeah. makes my day. It really makes my day. I'm sorry. It's a cartoon depicting the death of Osama bin Laden. Liberals, I'm sure the terrorists appreciate your sensitivity, but it's not going to stop them from cutting off your head. Right. Exactly. Especially exactly. if you're gay. Look, I, I still hate Bill Check because he's a cheater, right? Yeah. <laughs> but I got to defend him because he's my cheater now, right? <laughs> Although I still feel like I'm defending the guy who robbed the bank because he gave me 50 bucks, right? <laughs> and the best part is he wore that in Nantucket. Yes. <laughs> they, they had to let him slide. Yes. You know, those little ones up there had to let him go. But in the USA, the Census Bureau released the list of the fastest growing cities in America. Guess which state of the top 15 has six of them? Houston, That's Texas. right, Texas. That's right, Rosie. There's something special about Texas. Yeah, but Texas needs a new law right now going on. No anti-American liberals allowed. Yeah. And if yeah. you move to Texas and you're an anti-American liberal communist Democrat, you forfeit your right to vote in Texas. And no Muslims. Right there. Uh, or, or you can be shot. That's it. I don't get. I don't get around. Oh, that was yeah. spot on. Yeah. Hey, he, that yeah. was spot on. Just mesmerized by you, Rose. You're like everyone else. I mean, don't forget, it is his birthday after all. Uh, that's true. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a problem. I'm looking at this list and I'm like, I think I've nailed a chicken every town I, on this. Oh, but, oh, but, 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 but I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But to go along with what uh, Birthday Boy said, keep the liberals out and keep those damn toll roads out of here, too. Yes. Jesus. Yeah. 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 Jesus. Yeah. I'm from New York. People ask me all the time why I moved to Texas. Three reasons. Better weather. Yeah. No state income tax. Yeah. And all the jobs. All the jobs yes. are down here. Yeah. Would you like to play my bass uh, shovel? I mean, I am black, yeah. right? I mean, yeah. All, all black I know is a bad day in Texas <laughs> is better than a good day anywhere else. Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I can tell you, I'm from, coming from New Jersey to here, I I'm telling you, man, you have no idea how good it is. Oh, yeah. Hey, All folks, right. let's say hello to our Tommy's Gross announcer, Mr. Matthew Guidry. Yay! Yay! Matthew, you've had some good days and some bad days, right, in Texas? Sure. A good day is when we do Tommy's Garage. A bad day is when you pay me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thanks, Matt. Thank you. What's, com what's coming up, Matt? Without my paycheck, coming up later, <laughs> we have the professionals. But next, it's the Bigot Lottery. Yeah. Only on Tommy's Garage! Yeah.
healthcare system, broken. The FDA, broken. And the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. You locked your deadbolt, but this happened. Why? Because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins. You need Armor City Doors. There were over 1 million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone. But when deadbolts fail, Armor City Doors protects. Guaranteed. 713-487-5539. Or stop by ArmorCityDoors.com. Remember, deadbolts do not stop kick-ins. But when deadbolts fail, you need Armor City Doors. ArmorCityDoors.com. Hey, where can I get good local news? Pick up the Bayou City Bull. How about a good karaoke get bar? The Bayou City Bull. Great nightclub. The Bayou City Bull. A good ice house. The Bayou City Bull. Dry cleaner. The Bayou City Bull. Massage therapist. The Bayou City Bull. Hair salon. The Bayou City Bull. Nail salon. Nail salon. For a friend. Oh, and a bail bonds. Wild night. It's for a friend. friend. Yeah. The Bayou City Bull has local news, local entertainment, local businesses. It even has a joke page, coupons, and Houston calendar girls. Bay Town to Katy. King to Clear Lake. If you want to know what's going on, pick up a copy of the Bayou, Bayou City Bull. Bull. BayouCityBull.com And Twitter. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, I'm tweeting. Tweeting? What's that? It's Twitter. Twitter? What's Twitter? You tweet. Tweet. You don't tweet? I, I fart. Is that the same thing? Come on, dude. You're supposed to be helping me clean the pool. You're going to get me in trouble again. Yeah, all right. I'm coming. Yes, it's the big And we force ourselves to get I'm not getting in trouble because of him again. I'm getting proof he's not working. Come on, man, we gotta clean the pool. Right there. They're shopping at Walmart riding horses and doing silly that. Is that crazy or what? That's what we shop. Here we go. Oh, this water's freaking me out. Why are you watching this? So funny. He's watching the bigot lottery. On Tommy's garage. Dude, you just made the bigot lottery. Ah! The Bigot Lottery. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. It's the Bigot Lottery. I, I hope that that's what doesn't look like me. Yeah. yeah. Yes, it's the Bigot Lottery. Every week we find the biggest idiots who do the dumbest things, and we force ourselves to guess the race of the idiot, and thus embarrassing everyone in the process. Joining Rosie and Gavin is the lovely Brittany Lee. Oh, hello. Brittany Lee. Yeah. Hey, I've been wow. studying all week for this. I see she has a fan club. Yeah. Woo! By the way, before we even start, just real quick, I got both of them together. It's Rosie and Brittany's birthday this week. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Rosie and Brittany. Everybody, come on. Happy birthday to you. Shut up. Uh, Shut up. <laughs> Let's see the scoreboard. Matthew has a score up here, buddy. Tell me. Could I be good? <laughs> Rosie, sitting at 20. No. Said, no. 25. Learn how to count. One, two, three, four. Four times five. Oh. 21. 21. Okay. Sorry. I ain't. Brittany, I holding know. fast at 14. Yes. Is that correct? Yeah. Well, <laughs> Gavin's got 15, so we got a tight race here. Yeah. It's anybody's game. I like it tight. Anybody. 
How do you like that great graphic I put up there? That's pretty spiffy, isn't it? Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. Did I really? I'll have to fix it. All right. Well, we got some good ones here today, and only two weeks till the next trophy. Uh oh. Yeah. So you guys, uh -oh. is the panel ready? Uh oh. Is the panel ready? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Is the panel ready? Yeah. Are you guys ready? Yeah. All right. Let's begin the big lottery. Okay. This is not a stupid one, but it's really unusual. All right. In Indiana, a woman had a baby. Not just any baby. A big baby. Not just over 10 pounds, not just over 12 pounds, not just over 15 pounds. This was a 16-pound baby. Oh, That's right. Whoa, White, black, wow. Hispanic, or Asian, Rosie. Oh, my God. 16-pound baby. 16-pound baby. You know baby. where I'm going with this, Gavin. <laughs> you know where you're going. No, it, it wasn't not. Asian. That's what I wasn't thinking. 16-pound <laughs> oh, baby in Indiana? It's got to be a black chick. Gary. Oh. Gary. Rosie goes black. Oh, I'm really? just thinking about uh, Tubuku. <laughs> no, Tubuku. I think I'm going uh, black as well. Ooh! <laughs> Gavin, are you going to go online here or are you going to break the mold? You know, I've been trying to go and break the mold all season. You can't do it on this one, can you? I don't know. No, it's too no, difficult, no, isn't no, it? No, no, no. I know that black is the only thing that'll be able to fit in there after the baby, but. <laughs> I'm going to say white this time. White! Gavin goes white. What do you guys think? Wow. Let's meet our little bundle of joy, Waylon Cole. Hey! This one, big ass baby, and he is a cracker. Hell, he's more, he's not a cracker. He's an entire, he's an entire box of saltines. Holy crap! 16 pounds. 16, I thought they were going to name that kid what Brunswick. What the hell were they feeding that poor woman? They're going to name that kid Brunswick. Everything. All right. In Florida, a woman was running around a hotel lobby butt ass naked. Yeah. 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 The manager called the police. When they tried to arrest her, she kicked the cops, punched the cops. She even threw her clothes at them. <laughs> Big mistake assaulting a policeman in Florida. Felony, $10,000 bail. White, black, Hispanic, or Asian, Rosie. Florida running woman running around in a hotel lobby, butt ass naked. Yeah. yeah. Kick the cops, punch the cops. <laughs> yeah, Hispanic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rosie goes Hispanic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Brittany. Yeah, I would say uh, many times, you know, white people usually like leave their clothes behind and don't have their clothes to throw at the cops. Ah, that's I a good mean, point. I've heard, I don't know for sure, but um, I think uh, <laughs> that's gonna be more of a Hispanic thing. Ooh, yeah. Hispanic, and there's a little bit of a debate in your head on that one. Yeah, don't mm. follow me, I'm always wrong, so nobody don't, follows. don't keep saying nobody, what I'm saying. Nobody follows you, Rosie. No, I know. I, know. Hmm. I too have been debating, and my first question is, when's conjugal visit day? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, nice! I'm just curious. Nice. Uh, you know what? Screw it, black. Whoa! Hey. What do you guys think that out here? Different. Let's meet Brissa Dominguez. Yeah. 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 She is Hispanic, and guess what else? She's another Instagram model. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Except she, she can throw her clothes at me anytime she wants, baby. Yeah, except she has a bigger problem. She's Mexican. She's from Mexico, committing a felony. Uh oh, there's a new sheriff in town. See you on the other side of the border, muchacha. I'll go pay her bond. I'll get her out. Adios, yeah. adios, el culo magnifico. Somewhere in the world, there is a wedding, a beautiful traditional wedding ceremony, and a fun reception with everybody's all friends. Of course, there's always a few buttholes ruin everything, right? Right. And a fight broke out. Fist flying. Food flying, blood flying, it was quite a scene. But the groom knew just how to calm things down. He pulled out a gun and started shooting people. Yeah. Wow! Black. One, Black. one, Black. one dead. <laughs> He's in jail for Hold murder. On. Is our gung-ho groom from India, Pakistan, South Africa, or Arkansas? Arkansas. I'm going to Gavin on this one first. Ah. Come on, Gavin. <laughs> Let Gavin go first. All right, first of all, the voice just assumed he was black because he had a gun. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, yes, he did. So, just for that, I bet it was a white person from South Africa. Ah, just to you. People forget there's white people still in South Africa. That's I right. Know a few, yeah. Those people are crazy as hell. Brittany, yeah. they have to be. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. I'm going to see it's 50 50 South Africa or Arkansas. Well, you know, one, I mean, the Clintons it? are from Arkansas, yeah. and they like to uh, shoot yeah. people, or maybe not themselves. <laughs> like yeah. Kissing cousins, right? So which one are you doing? I'm going to go with Arkansas. Yay! Arkansas, wow. Rosie, what do you think? 
pulled out a gun and started shooting people at a wedding? Yeah. I say Pakistan's all over that one. Oh, yeah, Pakistan. What do you guys think out here? My wife's from Oh, he wasn't yeah. a white guy. Oh, you yeah, half right. Oh, half you a point. Was a, half off. It's a black guy. All, you, need, all you needed was a country. He got the country. That's all that mattered. Yeah. Yeah. I won the big part of that one. Yeah. <laughs> From a lifetime in Mary Bliss to a lifetime of taking up the poop shooting prison. That's right. Somewhere else in the world. What? We've all heard those. of internet stars who do crazy things to get people to sign up for the website, the webpage, right? Okay. Yeah. Or, or, or get a bunch of likes on Facebook, right? Yeah. How far would you go exactly? Well, a woman wondered how many likes she could get on her page if she took an eel and, um, uh, uh, you, you guys already figured it out, right? Yeah. No, 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 no. Yes, live on the internet! She shoved an eel up her honey tunnel. Oh! oh. oh. So she, so she, 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 she was lucky if it started making a nice meal out of its new home. Doctors were able to remove it from her happy hallway. Is she Irish, Chinese, Kenyan, or right here in Orange County, Los Angeles, home of the world's porno movies? Rosie. See, you're throwing me, you're trying to throw me off. You're trying to bait me into that Orange County, Los Angeles crap, aren't you? You know, you're trying, aren't, aren't you? Could be. Hey, I'm gonna go Orange County, Los Angeles. Yeah. Rosie goes Orange County. Hey. Brittany. Yeah, I'd say California's getting pretty desperate right about now. Oh, uh, really? Social equity is money, and, you know, fame is one of those the things. The two most important colors, ka -ching. Exactly. Blue exactly. Green. Well. Oh, so oh, I thought that she was still deciding. I'm, no, I, I'm, 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 I'm sorry. Orange County. I'm sorry. I was still thinking about what the honey tunnels like after an eel goes through it. Like, is it even? <laughs> you're I mean, always thinking about honey tunnels, aren't you? But it, but I'll is it even later. sweet anymore? And do you want to be there? <laughs> I, I don't even know. No, I'm gonna say Chinese. Okay. What do you guys think? Chinese. 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 Wow. Chinese. Show of hands. How many people say Chinese? Chinese. Wow. Let's meet Zhang Moo Moo. Yeah. She is from China. Her nickname is Kui Kui. You can find her right on the internet. She is apparently a famous uh, internet porno vlogger. I suspect business is rising from Miss Kui Kui. Oh. Yes. Are you sure? Uh, do you happen to have uh, Kui Kui's phone number? Uh, <laughs> it's for, it's for uh, a friend. It's not for me. It's for a friend. <laughs> yeah. That wraps up the big lottery. Let's I check out our know. scores, Matthew. How do we do? All right, Rosie. Killing him. 22. Brittany's catching up. She's at 15 now. And Gavin managed to pull out 18. Woo! Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Two? Yeah. Right. How'd you guys do out here? Four? Three? Hey, pretty good. All right. So um, let's uh, let's kick this thing out. Matthew gives you what's coming up next, Matthew. Well, first, I think uh, I'm voting for Rosie. Eel, kill him. Oh. <laughs> and we finish with how are you going to fix America as soon as I get done playing with my eel. See you in a minute. <laughs> it's Tommy's Garage. You locked your deadbolt, but this happened. Why? Because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins. You need armor city doors. There were over one million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone. But when deadbolts fail, armor city doors protects. Guaranteed. 713-487-5539. Or stop by armorcitydoors.com. Remember, deadbolts do not stop kick-ins. But when deadbolts fail, you need armor. Armor City Doors. ArmorCityDoors.com. Healthcare system broken. The FDA broken. And the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. 
Hey, where can I get good local news? Pick up the Bayou City Bull. How about a good karaoke get the bar? Bayou City Bull. Great nightclub. Bayou City Bull. A good ice house. The Bayou City Bull. Dry cleaner. The Bayou City Bull. Massage therapist. Bayou City Bull. Hair salon. Bayou City Bull. Nail salon. Nail salon. For a friend. Oh, and a bail bondsman. Wild night. It's for friend. a friend. Yeah. The Bayou City Bull has local news, local entertainment, local businesses. It even has a joke page, coupons, and Houston calendar girls. Bay Town to Katie. Kingwood to Clear Lake. If you want to know what's going on, pick up a copy of the Bayou City Bull. BayouCityBull.com and Twitter. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, I'm tweeting. Tweeting? What's that? It's Twitter. Twitter? What's Twitter? Tweet. Tweet. You don't tweet. I, I fart. Is that the same thing? and completely crushes their lifetime legacy of hard work. Uh, let's say hello once again to the big man, comedian Mike Rayo. Yeah. Yeah. Filmmaker and TV star Matt Miller. Yeah. And comedian Super Sam Friesbaum. Yeah. Yeah. There's our three professionals. Let's see our stories. First up, in Raleigh, North Carolina, an American Airlines flight was evacuated. A caustic odor caused the evacuation. Huh? Leaking hydraulic fluid? No. Battery acid? No. Now a passenger cut a big, nasty fart. No! And the plane was evacuated. <laughs> Mike, where exactly were you on July 16th? <laughs> Well, under the advice of my attorney and the agreement I entered into with American <laughs> Airlines, I have to plead the fifth. I will say on January 6, 2016, in January 2016, the same thing happened. Plane had to land. And this is the note that one of the passengers passed to the flight attendant. They said, if you can find out who is passing gas from aisles 10 to 12, please have them see a doctor because judging by the smell, they have ass cancer. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I just want to take this opportunity to clear the air. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. oh, hold on, hold on. Get anything at all on that one? The push. <laughs> That's my first pun oh, ever. Push on that one. <laughs> no. Hey, Mike and I were in Riley. We were eating boiled peanuts and having a deviled egg eating contest. Ooh. <laughs> I didn't say. I it, can't though. let him take the heat on this alone. Ooh. Hey, is this a shark story? It's <laughs> <laughs> You know, they don't sell underwear in the mall. <laughs> Who knew? Who knew? <laughs> you know, what, what, comedians are not supposed to laugh at their own jokes. <laughs> He's allowed to have In this case, we make an exception because that's worth it. Oh, my gosh. So, so, <laughs> so someone cut the cheese and the flight attendants whined. <laughs> I guess in this instance, he who smelt it should have flown dealt it. <laughs> oh! Yeah. Oh, sing, wow. sing, sing, sing. <laughs> and that is why Sammy Greasebum is in third chair. Okay. I'm <laughs> moment of truth, moment of truth here. Admit this. Who here spotted it on an airplane? Ah, yeah, yeah. Well, that, brings, that brings a tear to my eyes. <laughs> Let's go to the next story, because in Britain, a woman went to her eye doctor. She was having a bit of discomfort. When the doctors looked in her eye, they found 27 contact lenses oh all stuck together, Mike. Wow, with that many lenses, you should be able to see into the future. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing I'm guessing she was real popular with the opposite sex. Uh, hey, can I buy you a drink? Uh, no, thank you. Uh, how about take you home? No, uh, no, that's okay. I don't, I, I can't. Uh. <laughs> she did see him in the future. OJ goes back to jail. <laughs> 
I guess they should have suspected something was wrong when they found out she was wearing 14 pairs of underwear. <laughs> <laughs> what I want to know, though, did anybody check her for IUDs? <laughs> Because <laughs> things might be stacked up in there. <laughs> That's the first fly bell I ever did. <laughs> Suicide. What? No. Yeah, it's yeah. worse, worse than stinky. <laughs> in Washington, D.C., at the Georgetown Waterfront Mall, there's a sad moment. A suicide victim named Steve drowned in the mall fountain oh. right in front of people. You want to see the picture? Take a look. <laughs> Poor uh, Yeah. Uh. Steve, the nice go K5 robot, he's a crime fighting mall robot. <laughs> he drove himself into a watery grave at the Georgetown Mall Water Fountain. Mike, it's a sad day for robots everywhere. <laughs> it is. This, I guess this doesn't surprise me. He probably had aspirations of working for the FBI. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ends up as a mall cop. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know what this robot had on Hillary. <laughs> 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 Right there. Well, well, apparently, electronically, he figured out that resistance is futile. Oh! 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 Oh!
going to potentially harm things, and they ignored us. So this is what you get. You get Caitlyn Jenner, you get Kid Rock, and you'll like it. Hey, yeah. yeah. hey, yeah. hey wrap the vote. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah. I got news for you. If uh, whoever debates Kid Rock better bring a helmet. And that's all yeah, I got. Really. And an ashtray. Well, I'll tell you what. They both repeal Obamacare, cut taxes, and build that wall. I'll join them. Exactly. Wait, yeah. so, that may not be the best way to put that, would it be? I'll join them. <laughs> All right, speaking of icons, in China, pro-democracy radicals... Took a second, took you a second, did to get that. Pro-democracy radicals have embraced a special icon to inspire the fight for independence. And the Chinese government has banned this radical icon from China. What is this vicious symbol that strikes terror into the hearts of Chinese bureaucrats and threatens the very existence of the Chinese government? Um, we got you! Winnie the Pooh, Mike. Oh, Paulo. Uh, <laughs> you know, I'm glad we live in a country where uh, celebrity lookalikes can be just embraced, uh, like this one. And this one. <laughs> I can't do which one's up. Uh, one one more. Wait. Oh, hey! 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 No, no, no. Who did that? Who did that? <laughs> Um, I we're worried that these people own six percent of our debt. I mean, seriously, we can get we can stir their bees nest, you know, <laughs> with a big, big pale bear with no pants on. That gives me an idea. What the hell are you doing, Mark? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing, Mark? Yeah. Yeah. I got an idea. Let's yeah, go to China. Let's go take over China. Give my pants on. Yeah, yeah, I'll tell you that. Just, just us. Need a red shirt. <laughs> Keep your pants. Xi Jinping, Xi Jinping, chubby little leader of communist China. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You know what's real? What really sucks? Somewhere on an assembly line in China, there are a bunch of people working for Disney, making those things by the millions. Yeah. Yes. 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 Yeah. Quick, make them quick out. We have to get them out of here. Yeah. Yeah. And those production triples. Uh, <laughs> there's a method to that madness. You know what? I feel better about these idiots owning, owning our debt. You know, just speaking of debt, it's time to pay a few bills. Let's run some ads and make some money, Matthew. What's left of this mess, please? Come here and say no. How to Fix America, only on Tommy's Garage! I'm not getting in trouble because of him again. I'm getting proof he's not working. Come on, man, we gotta clean the pool. Why are you watching? It's so funny. He's watching the bigot lottery on Tommy's garage. Dude, you just made the bigot lottery. Ah! You locked your deadbolt, but this happened. Why? Because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins. You need armor, city, doors. There were over one million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone. But when deadbolts fail, armor, city, doors protects. Guaranteed. 713-487-5539. Or stop by armorcitydoors.com. Remember, deadbolts do not stop kick-ins. But when deadbolts fail, you need armor. Armor City Doors. ArmorCityDoors.com. Hey, where can I get good local news? Pick up the Bayou City Bull. How about a good karaoke get the bar? Bayou City Bull. Great nightclub. The Bayou City Bull. A good ice the house. Bayou City Bull. Dry cleaner. The Bayou City Bull. Massage therapist. Bayou City Bull. Hair salon. Bayou City Bull. Nail salon. Nail salon. For a friend. Oh, and a bail bonds. Wild night. It's for a friend. friend. Yeah. The Bayou City Bull has local news, local entertainment, local businesses. It even has a joke page, coupons, and Houston calendar girls. Bay Town to Katy. Kingwin to Clear Lake. If you want to know what's going on, pick up a copy of the Bayou, Bayou City Bull. Bull. BayouCityBull.com and Twitter. Healthcare system broken. The FDA broken. And the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. Okay, we're going to make sure that you never buy any products 
from any sponsor of any liberal communist news organization. Let's do to them what they're doing to us, shut them down, and then we write letters to all of these sponsors and tell them about what we're doing. And I shut like all of them down. Yeah. 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 Flat tax for all Americans. Ooh, I love yeah, that. Nice. Yeah, yeah, fair. Yeah, Second, yeah. if you've seen Suicide Squad, that <laughs> invisible fence thing that they put into them, <laughs> get all of the illegals out of here, use prison workers for all the fields and all that bullshit. They'll never run. I love it. My key to fixing America is more ecological. For decades, we've been hearing that they can't get rid of disposable diapers or build one that'll break down in 50,000 years. And we don't know what to do with nuclear waste. I say put in the disposable diapers. Either way, that's one problem solved. Yeah. <laughs> Show. So remember, pull up a chair, pop open that fear. It's time for Tommy's Garage. Come on. Ah!